Stacy Burke here, and it's a Monday, so it's time for a grocery haul. <laughs> a little annoyed it's a Monday, but it's later in the day because <sighs> there was so many, and I don't work that, I don't live too far from where I work, but there was road construction everywhere I went, and then there was an accident on the detours, and the detours had detours, had detours, had detours. And I almost didn't go to the grocery store. I almost went to a different grocery store, but they were terrible. And I'm like, no, I was really out of stuff, and I really wanted to go. So I'm a little late. I'm a half an hour late, but it's all good. Not for you. It's all good. I'm a little discombobulated because, seriously, it took me a long time to get in and out and zoom in it. Like, anyway, just detour everywhere. Oh, the refrigerator's making a noise. Anyway, today's magic number is $84, and I forgot the cents. You'll probably see it. About $84. I spent probably more than I probably really wanted to, but, well, actually, no. I actually needed more stuff. Actually, I probably would have spent more, but I just was so over everything. I just grabbed what I needed and went out. I didn't really do that much for the moment stuff. Um, there's a few things I wanted to get, but I think I'll probably get, um, at Rite Aid, like allergy medicine, something like that. Too expensive at the grocery store. Anyway, so let me show you what I got. First of all, I'm completely out of cat litter. <laughs> Last time I thought I could survive on it, but I did have to fill up one of the cat litter things, so I'm completely out. So I had to get, uh, some more cat litter. Here we go. Just, uh, the normal scented, uh, scoopable. This is like $5.99, so I had to get more cat litter. So I'll put that away. Um, let's see. Well, didn't really need cheese, but I'm like, I'll get something. Uh, maybe I'll get some sliced cheese in case I want to make some sandwiches. So I got some Munster cheese. This was on sale for like $2.49, and it's actually was a good price because this is like some kind of like the Petite Farmer's Market or something like that. It's kind of a nicer brand. So I'm like, okay, I'll get some good cheese. And, Miss Josephine, they finally had your shredded carrots. Yay, they had your shredded carrots. So, I got some shredded carrots so I don't have to keep chopping up the other ones. These are a lot better for her to, to, in the morning. They're easier for her to, her to eat. We're out of tang because um, the kid likes the tang. And I, I keep tang around, too. And I don't drink that much stuff. Like, someone asked me, like, what do I drink? Do I drink any, like, sodas? And no, the answer is no. I usually drink a cup of coffee in the morning. And I drink water all through the day. Um, and then maybe at night I might have a glass of wine or something. And sometimes I keep uh, Tang on hand if I want to make like a mimosa or something. Because orange juice doesn't make sense for me because I don't drink that much orange juice. It would spoil. However, they will drink it a lot because they do drink orange juice. So I just like to have Tang on hand. And then whenever in need, I can make it. And I don't have to worry about it spoiling. Uh, so this makes a lot. So six quarts, you know, so I mean, per serving, I mean, I, this kind of goes far. I make a lot. And then I got some lettuce that they finally have romaine back. So it must be that this is probably okay. It's on sale for 99 cents and this romaine heart lettuce. So I got more lettuce. That's what I always get. And what's this? Oh, I was feeling like Indian food tonight, but I don't know if I'm going to make it tonight. I don't know how much this was. It probably wasn't on sale, but this is like vegan. Indian food is Amy's. It's Indian. I can't pronounce it, but paneer, paneer. I love this kind of stuff. So I was craving some Indian food, so I'm not sure if I'm going to have it tonight. And if I want to make it more spicy, I have some cayenne pepper I can sprinkle on it. So I don't know. I might have that tonight. I might not. And I think we need more some jelly because I got some... I think it was orange or apricot jelly or apricot jam. I'm sorry. Oh, no, apricot preserves because I usually like to get preserves. But I don't think the kid likes it so much. I should not probably not call him kid anymore. He's 18 now. Uh, but, um, but he likes my uh, blackberry uh, preserves. So I got into that. So we have two open bottles of preserves. I usually get preserves. But I'm thinking, you know what, just to be on the safe side, this was on sale it's just normal grape jelly, and I don't usually do jelly. I like preserves, like I like the fruit, I like it more fruity. But I figured might as well keep this on hand because he does go through the jelly quite a lot. So I got him some jelly, and got Frankie Farmer's cat food, like 
when I was stuck in traffic and I, I thought, well, maybe I can't get to my Ralph's because there was like a motorcycle accident, there's cops, and like they had a detour. I, I tried Vons. There's this little tiny Vons. It's not like a big Vons. It's a tiny Vons. And I, I first tried to go grocery shopping there. They didn't have any of Frankie Farter's food. All they have was shredded. He needs pate. And, they, and everything was expensive, and they didn't have anything. So I got in my car, and I went into traffic, and I said, screw it. I'm going to my Ralph's. I'm going to my Ralph's. I'm going to my Kroger. So that's why I'm really late. I'll just get the freezer bags. Although, I might not have to get them next time. I think they're slowing down their roll. They're not using as many as they usually do. So... So maybe I'll slow my roll on that. Okay. Now I got some toilet paper from a sale. Back up. I still have some, but you know I always get back up. So that's my toilet paper. And I got more paper towels. Because we've been using them because me and the kid both have allergies. I don't usually use these to be honest with you. I actually use a um like a dishcloth, like a paper towel. Not a paper towel, like a like a washcloth. That I use it for like a hanky and then I, I just wash it because I work at a laundromat. So I actually use like normal like hankies and I wash them. It saves a lot on paper. It saves a lot. Now I said I don't use I don't drink soda, but I was kind of craving a squirt. And I got diet squirt because I guess they have caffeinated squirt and decaffeinated squirt, and I didn't know which one to get. Oh, this one's caffeine free, so this is good. This is no caffeine, because I don't know. So I'm, I don't really need the caffeine, but sometimes I wonder if maybe I do. But I just got diet, and I don't usually like to get diet because artificial uh, sugar, that fake sugar, is really not good for you. But hopefully the kid will help me drink it. Oh, yeah, that's why I like squirt. It's grapefruit soda. No wonder. I was thinking about maybe this will go good with my champagne if I don't feel like having juice in it. Like, just make it more refreshing. So, I was thinking about putting this in my champagne. I might get the regular squirt next time because I'd rather have real sugar than fake sugar. Like, fake sugar is really not good for you. It's like man-made crap. And I think it messes with your brain. I don't know. I don't like it. I got more water because I've been doing really good on the water lately because I was I kind of had a cold uh, this weekend, I didn't do anything this weekend. I literally stayed on the couch, watched movies all weekend because it was cold, it was windy, and I was uh, had a cold, so I didn't feel good. And then I got better on Sunday, so I was going to do something on Sunday, but then I had an allergy attack. So either I had an allergy attack or a cold. So I was, like, miserable this weekend. So I just stayed on the couch this weekend, and I drank a lot of water, a lot of water. So I got more water. I got more champagne. I got Brut. You know, I always get the champagne, and I always like the Brut. Now, this was $5.99. <sighs> and then I got some more creamer, and I always get the Cinnabon, but I'm like, you know what? I really need to try something, even though I've had this be one before. It's good. This is sweet cream. It basically tastes like vanilla ice cream in your coffee. That's basically what it tastes like. But I got some sweet cream uh, coffee creamer. I only got one thing of wine, because like I said, I'm, I haven't been really drinking that much wine, but um, I went through one bottle for the whole week, so that's nothing. That's like four glasses for like in seven days. So I went ahead and got one more wine, and this was on sale for like a dollar fifty nine, and I already have some tortilla chips, but the guys like it, so I, you know, for a dollar fifty nine, it's good to have on hand in case they want some. So I thought I would give them to that. And I got more trail mix. They have my bulk ready. So I got some trail mix and I have some um, pretzels at work that I'm going to mix them up with. So I always get my bulk trail mix. Uh, so I'm all chippers. It's that, that traffic. And now i got to really hurry up and put things away. Okay. Now... I think they need bread. I think they're out of bread. And I don't know what kind of bread they want. So I just went in the back and seen what was on sale. This was on sale for 70 cents. And I think they just get normal white bread. You know, and if they don't like it, it's not a big deal. It was only 70 cents. So I'm hoping they won't mind that I got them some bread. 
because I noticed they're out of it. I think they're sick too because I noticed they haven't went into the grocery store. So I thought, okay, I'm gonna get grab a few things, like a few staples, you know. And I got more tortillas because they like them too. And uh, and I I got the normal flour ones this time. I was just in too much of a hurry to get the wheat ones. I've been trying to eat the wheat tortillas. I don't know if they're better for you. I'll probably get the wheat tortillas next time. Uh, and I bought these the other time. I haven't had them yet, but the kid likes them. So I got more. I've been noticing he's been eating them. So I got more cupcakes for him. So they're only two bucks. And they've been liking the ice cream. And I know they like the butter pecan. Now, this is the one I was telling you about. Like, they don't have any butter pecan um, ice cream at my store for some reason, except for this one. And this is um, lactose-free, no sugar added, reduced fat. So it's good for me. I think it's great. But I don't know if they will because um, it's like like low sugar, lactose-free. Although the kid said he's um, lactose intolerant a little bit. So he might like it. And I know his father wants him to get a weight stop having so much sugar so they might like it so I'm hoping they'll like that and I've been keeping this on hand even though I didn't get any ruffles potato chips because this goes best with ruffles potato chips I don't have any ruffles potato chips but I'll probably take this to work with me uh, because we have we have a vending machine with potato chips so this is probably gonna go to work with me my French onion dip and it's kind of expensive. It's like over, like it's three dollars. Well, it was on sale for three dollars. That's on sale for that little thing. So, but oh well. This was. Now they don't have my spray butter. My I can't believe it's spray butter. So I just went ahead and got this. This is two dollars. This is parquet squeeze. It's not the spray. It's not the spray. But it is liquid butter. Well, it's not really butter. It's basically vegetable spread. But um. You know, sometimes I don't, sometimes you don't want something already melted. You don't want, like, hard butter on something. You, you want, like, soft butter. And so, I don't know if you could spray it. I wonder if I could put my spray thing in there and see if it sprays. If it does spray, that's awesome. But I don't think it sprays. But anyway, I got the squeeze. And I've been craving um, hummus. I got the... Um, what do you call the bubble ganoush last time, which was really good. I loved it. Uh, I put some like red onion in it. It was so good. But this was on sale again for $2.49, and this is the fire chipotle pepper. It's the same one I bought like a few weeks back. So I'm like, oh, cool. So I don't know. I might have this later on tonight, or I might make the Indian food later on tonight. I don't know. I'm not that hungry, so I have a feeling I might just snack on this tonight with like a salad. So anyway, that is my grocery haul. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. It's $94. I don't think I got that much, but, you know, cat litter, that costs a lot, and, you know, I didn't get ice cream, so, you know, I think I did okay. $94. I didn't go over 100 but I think if I wasn't so discombobulated by the, all the traffic detours, I think I could have did better. Like, I probably would have been able to, like, take my time and look at the prices and see which ones. And I may have made some different choices, but it is what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. So I'm all happy with my choices. I'm all good. Josephine got her um, carrots. I got the, the cat litter. That was the main things I wanted to get. So it's all good. So there you go. There's my grocery haul. To all my stays cadets and all my cats. I hope you have a groovy day. Until next time, cheers. <laughs> I don't say that. I say peace. I'm just confabulated. Bye, guys. <laughs>